Broadly, my lab is interested in the field of cell mechanics. So basically, we're interested in how forces, either in the environment of cells or generated by cells, affect their behavior. And we apply this mostly to cancer. The prevailing thought in cancer is that cells start in a primary tumor, and then they start invading out into the tissue. Um, they get into either the circulatory system or the lymph system, and then that's how they spread to a secondary site. Our work has been uh, trying to explore how it is that cells actually move through tissue with the idea that if you could stop the cells from moving, you could stop them from spreading. I think the goal of the Keck Foundation is really to take things that shift paradigms. We have some really compelling preliminary data where we sorted cells based on how migratory they are. Um, and then we looked at how well they metastasize. And surprisingly, what we found was the relationship was inversely correlated. So basically, the cells that were the, the strongest migrators, the ones that were really good at moving, were really bad at spreading to secondary sites. Um, so once they hit the circulation and then they land in, in the lungs or the liver, they don't do very well at, at forming secondary tumors. But the cells that are weakly migratory, surprisingly, it turns out that they were really highly metastatic. Um, so when we think about how to apply this to patients, um, that is our ultimate goal, is looking at um, potential drugs that are already on the market that could get repurposed for this. But I think that is um, by far the biggest strength um, at, for Vanderbilt for biomedical research, uh, is the, the strength of the Vanderbilt University Medical Center coupled with the strength of the Vanderbilt um, Engineering School. Um, and all of that is basically orchestrated um, through, through this one Vanderbilt.